Here we are at the Kung Fu Saloon at South by Southwest checking out the uh, open stack installer aka codename Crowbar uh, and see how it is uh, going. Let's go take a look inside. All right, there he is, getting getting stuff set up. How you doing, Greg? Doing well. All right, just at the very beginning, getting all our equipment set up. Crowbar is an admin node and a bunch of computers. The admin node takes care of running things like your provisioning server as well as a bunch of your services that you need to run a cloud. In our experience, Greg, how you doing? Doing good. So you just did the whole open uh, the Crowbar OpenStack install. Uh, all it, in its all its glory, uh, just finished doing that. Can you tell us a little bit about what is Crowbar and, and how does it work with, with OpenStack, the open source cloud platform? Okay, so Crowbar is um, an OpenStack installer provisioner environment. Our goal is to provide three things, something that will install Crowbar, let you manage and operate it, and then provide a control layer on top of that so that you can take advantage of exploring OpenStack both its storage and its compute platforms without necessarily having to get into the details of how you configure it and how you get it running in your environment. And about how long does it take to, to get it up and going using Crowbar? So our goal is to try and get from boxes to cloud in about an hour. Now, I think the marketing guys have said four, but we're shooting for an hour in our, in our trials here. And it seems like today we were able to do about three nodes in about 30 minutes to get them up and running via OpenStack system. And then where does uh, Chef play in? How does, how does that come into so, play? So one of our, our partner in this is Opscode, and they provide Chef, which is a automated tool for provisioning and consistently deploying servers. And so what we use is we use that as the basis for Crowbar for both the data storage parts that we can track and use its asset tracking pieces, as well as its cookbooks and recipes for bringing up services. And so what we have Dell have done in working with them is create cookbooks that allow you to bring up Nova and Swift, the parts of OpenStack, in a prescribed and consistent manner so that you don't have to worry about, did I get this variable right, did I make these config changes properly, those kind of things. And so no, this is still a little bit early days. You're, you're looking for folks to test this out? Yeah, so what we want to do is before We've committed to putting this out as an open source project. And so one of the things that we're looking for is some people that were people that are interested in trying OpenStack and getting it out there and, and playing with it and actively working to see if that's right for them so that we can get some feedback as well as what they think is needed and one, if Crowbar works at all. And so given that, that's, that's what we're looking for. And if they're interested, they can send us an email at openstack at dell.com or they can go to dell.com slash openstack. Excellent. Greg Altos, thank you so much. Thanks.